yesterday have been seen the different concepts of your java programming language that is how we going to use with the, the finalized garbage collection and the different examples how actually the finalized is going to work on your programming language so we will be seeing with the very another next important part of your java inner classes they are also a part of your static keyboard they are the part of your static keyboard java inner class are nothing but classes nested within another class is called as java inner classes so you have seen already what actually meant by an if nest, nested if nested if means a if another in another if nested for means a for another another for like that way you're going to call here if a class is defined within another class we can call that one as what inner class or a nested class also can be called here java inner class or a nested class is a class which is declared inside the class or a another interface we use inner classes to logically group classes and interface in one place so that it can be more reliable and maintainable when there is a case of executing the different set of objects within a single class and defining outer as well as inner class can be done within defining those all the things within particular statement here just you can check out here you are going to have the syntax of an inner class where the class java outer class is defined within the braces with class java inner class means a class is defined with another class we can call this one as what nested class or inner classes so you can have an advantages over here there are three different advantages you want to have they are as follows nested classes represent a special type of relation that is it can access all the members of outer class including private already had been said that another class could not use the private members of other class wherein which that can be avoided by defining with your inner classes or nested classes what are the nested classes can do if any members of a outer class or another class are defined with private or something else they can be accessed by inner classes that can be done by using with the nested classes nested classes are used to develop more readable and maintainable code because it's logically group classes and interfaces in one place only what do you mean by this one this is nothing but what when you are going to execute uh, informations without uh, without having any sort of part at that position you will be having a readability as well as maintainability will be there because it is going to say that logically group of classes become more than one class can be defined within a single part at that position you can have a logically group of classes code optimization can be done yes 100% it requires very less code to write down the statements okay so this is how you want to go for a java inner classes java inner classes can be defined one class defined within another class we can call that one as a java inner classes types of inner classes you are going to have <coughs> or nested classes member inner class anonymous inner class and local inner classes and those can also be said as static nested classes they are member in classes a class created within a class and outside method that is called as member inner class anonymous inner class means a class created for implementing interface or extending a class its name is decided by the java compiler local inner class means a class created within the method static nested class means a class a static class created within the other class or within the class nested interface means a interface created within a class or a interface so these are the different types of types or different types of nested classes or inner classes you are going to have the above three are the <coughs> non static nested classes and the next two are the static nested classes that is static nested class and nested interface these are the two things because why you are going to call them as non means non static nested classes because they are referring the class but not utilizing where static nested classes are referring as well as utilizing each and everything within the class itself so we can call them as non static and as well as static so you're going to have the examples over here 
a non static class that is created inside a class but outside method is called as member in a class what are you going to say here you will be having a statement over here class test member outer one which is having a private int of data is equal to 30 okay and you are defining another class which is going to call a statement of a test member outer because you are accessing this data here member inner class we can call so you are defining with the member class here this is a member which is going to be with inner so how are you going to call this one just you are going to create a test member outer object is equal to name test member and test member outer one dot inner why you want to say test member outer one because you are created and class within another class if you call this one then only the class will be called and you want to create object the object will be object dot new inner the object dot new inner means it goes to test member of outer it will be going there and then afterwards it comes to the inner within that one you are going to have a message whether you have written any msg here no no this is called as what defining of a function then afterwards what you are going to do in dot message in dot message is called as member inner class which is going to call the inner class member through the outer class we can call that one as member inner class so understand it is a very simple statement inner class member will be calling the data of outer class we can call that one as member inner class okay then you can have java anonymous inner class anonymous inner class means no name is given a class which is not going to have any name we can call that one as anonymous for example abstract class person within the bracket abstract void it so here actually you are going to define another inner class but you are not defining any inner class but you are executing with the void it is in a function of your person class so public static void main person p is equal to new person and you are calling that particular person function within the wired main program and you are executing that one and then afterwards outside of the class outside of the class you are going to call p dot it so it is called as non or a, a anonymous inner class means a class is not going to have any name outer class that through that outer class you are going to call the <coughs> why would eat statement local inner class means simply you can have here means what you can show local inner class means you are defining the information and you are going to call that information within that class itself okay so you can check public public class local inner is outer class private int data is equal to 30 why would a display within the display what you are doing you are going with class local why would message system dot dot print ln of data so local l is equal to new local this is called as what local inner class so this is going to call within the class it is going to create an object within the class itself and it is going to execute how public static why would mean of local inner class object is equals to new local inner class so it is going to create an object for your outer class and outer class will be calling the method what this method is going to do it is going to call here and this class this method will be executing a class and a class will be creating an object this object creation is nothing but called as local inner class means you are calling through the member function of the outer class and you are creating object and you are going to execute that one and 20 will be displayed back to you this is called as <coughs> an local inner class and if any classes defined with the static they are called as static nested classes and as well as nested interfaces so some of the examples are there if you are going to have any java editors within your home you just execute them then we can go for the next part in the next class thank you very much